guys welcome back to my channel my name is may and on this channel i aim to help online entrepreneurs grow their online business and create a massive online income so if you are new here don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell so that you won't miss any of my future videos in today's video i'll be sharing the top five productivity hacks and tips for online entrepreneurs the productivity hacks and tips that i will be sharing today will be especially useful for online entrepreneurs who runs your business from home so i am a very good example because I am an online entrepreneur I run my online business from home because I need to take care of my families and because of that I realized that my main struggle is to balance between my work and my life so in order for me to take care of my family and at the same time do my business I need to increase my productivity so that I can accomplish every single task every single day being productive is one of my top priority so that I can get more things done in a day I have selected the top five productivity hacks and tips for you today and these productivity hacks are not the common ones so you won't be expecting me to tell you to plan your day ahead and so on these are the top five hacks that i feel that has helped me tremendously recently especially has helped me increase my productivity last year so the very first productivity hack that i have for you is to listen to upbeat music i do have a habit of listening to music while i'm working because this relaxes my mood but you need to choose your music wisely do not choose those very slow music like this because you will feel very sleepy while you're working and it's not gonna help your productivity at all instead listen to this type of upbeat music it will keep you very motivated to continue working hence it will also increase your productivity because you are much more motivated and much more hype up to continue working my second productivity hack is to prepare your food or get convenient but healthy food i'm not asking you to buy convenient food like the instant noodles type the thing to remember here is you need to get yourself healthy also so you need to get convenient and healthy food since i'm mostly at home i have the luxury to prepare my own food but sometimes preparing food at home can be very tiring and time consuming so my head is always buy in bulk healthy and easy to prepare food and store it in my fridge when it comes to meal time i just need to take out from my freezer and prepare the food instantly sometimes when i do not have so much of time i just need to whip up something very very simple another thing that i like to do is to meal prep in advance this way when it comes to meal time i can just take out the food that i have prepped and just heat it up my meal will be ready in one minute's time by doing meal prepping in advance you can save a lot of time during the meal time so that you can focus more on your work whenever i do a full cooking session it will take me more than one hour my meal prepping are usually for my lunch time and for my breakfast i usually go for something very very simple and nutritious which i'm going to show you shortly this is one of the product that i've been loving recently because it is very nutritious and it saves me a lot of time as well so this is one of the instant and healthy food that i've recently discovered i have been loving it because it is so fast to whip up my breakfast and it contains a lot of nutrients because it contains 16 types of superfood so this is uh, by timmy and this uh, this is one of their products is called the greens superfood blend so it contains 16 types of different superfood and it is 100 percent plant-based it's vegan it's gmo free gluten free dairy and soy free as well so they do not have any fillers additives artificial flavors no artificial colors or artificial chemicals so basically this is a whole food and there's no additional ingredients that is going to harm your body so this is really very perfect for my lifestyle so it is very important to start your morning right and because we need to eat a variety of food we need to get many ingredients into our body as a busy online entrepreneur it is really time consuming and it's not easy for us to always prepare the food and get many different kinds of ingredients into our body so this type of instant and healthy food is really very helpful for us as an online entrepreneur there are several ways that we can consume this timmy greens superfood blend you can just add it into water you can just mix it into your juice you can make a smoothie and also a porridge you can blend it with any fruits uh, like banana or avocado just add in some milk 
and that's it you can get yourself a smoothie bowl their main ingredients is matcha spirulina and wheatgrass some of the ingredients listed here will be wheatgrass chlorophyll powder spirulina powder corella powder spinach leaf powder broccoli powder kale powder kelp powder rocket leaf powder parsley powder celery grape seed extract dandelion extract they have matcha powder, acai berry, and Garcinia Cambodia. So these are the only ingredients they have. So that's why I mentioned just now, they do not have any additives in this product. So it is really safe for vegans, safe for keto, safe for any dieters out there. During my busy mornings, I usually just add one scoop of Timmy Green uh, Superfood Blend and just add water. I'll just add water into this uh, Timmy tumbler and I add one scoop of this like so and I just shake it. So this is how I drink my greens. Uh, sometimes when I do have trainings or meetings outside, I just grab this uh, as my breakfast. It tastes like earthy greens and it is very yummy. So this is one of the instant and healthy food that I want to recommend to you. I will leave a link down in the description box below. You can get a 15% discount with a minimum purchase of $29 with my code SUPERMOM15 or a 20% discount with a minimum purchase of $40 with my code SUPERMOM20. My productivity tip number three is to learn to say no. Being an online entrepreneur, we have the flexibility to plan out our day and also we have the time freedom. And because of this flexibility and freedom, we need to always remind ourselves to focus back the task at hand. So it is very important for you to learn to say no. So what are the things that you need to learn to say no to? This includes saying no to things that are unplanned for. For example, you have somebody coming forward to you and asking you for a collaboration which is not related to your business or you are being invited to a leisure event. These are some of the examples that you should say no to. I understand that sometimes you might be tempted to say yes to certain invitations but in order for you to increase your productivity you need to focus back the task at hand my productivity hack number four is to make chores productive this is a very interesting one because it is really leisure plus multitasking so i don't feel that i am actually working so doing chores is very boring even though you are an online entrepreneur i believe that you have things to do at home which are not related to your work so because I'm a mom and I need to take care of the house, I have plenty of chores to do at home. One of the chores that is really very time consuming is to do my laundry. So while I do laundry, I like to listen to podcasts as well as listen to trainings that I've signed up for. This way, it saves me a lot of time. I can listen to the training and do the chores at the same time. So my chores is not so dreadful anymore. My productivity tip number five is to get rid of all distractions. I will always declutter my workspace and remove all the distractions. Leave your work desk as empty as possible and only include things that are related to your job. Remove all the snacks, game controls, TV controller, lifestyle magazines, and any other gadgets that is not related to your work. This way you can fully focus on your work and complete all your tasks that you need to do for the day. I hope today's sharing is helpful to all the online entrepreneurs out there. If you have any other productivity hacks and tips, please share with me down in the comment section below and I'll see you in my next one. Bye-bye!